Hello everyone, welcome to Metaverse Insider. How to set up Oculus Quest 2 Virtual Guardian Oculus Virtual Guardian is a built-in safety feature that lets you set up boundaries in VR that appear when you get too close to the edge of your play area. This allows for the user to move around an area safely, avoiding accidents like walking into walls or furniture. If you want to redraw your boundary, you can do so at any time. Whether you move furniture or want to expand your space, you can easily update or replace your guardian. Oculus Quest 2 allows you to set up your boundaries in different modes. Your space and preference will dictate which mode works best for you. You can play games in a room scale with the ability to walk around in the play area or in a stationary mode sitting or standing in one place. Room scale works best 6.5 by 6.5 feet of space or larger. Evaluate your space and determine which mode works best. First, let's find a play area in a well-lit room and clear as much as space as possible. Remove any obstacles which you might collide with while you are in your virtual environment and take note of any overhead hazards. Avoid use of the headset in near or under objects, pets, or other things that could cause injury. The first step in Guardian setup is to calibrate tracking by setting the floor. To calibrate and set the height of the floor, gently lower your controller to the ground and look at it. You should see a virtual grid appear near the floor. Once the grid is correctly at the floor level, hit continue. Remember to always wear your touch controller wrist straps when using VR. When setting up Guardian for the first time, you should see what we call pass-through. Pass-through is a feature which allows you to take a quick look at the outside world to help you get oriented in space while wearing the device. Pass-through is essential for creating your play area. Next, it's time to define your play area. Defining your play area will help Guardian notify you if you start to move outside of it. Point the controller and use the trigger button on the controller to trace a play area. Be sure to leave extra space between your play area and your walls, furnitures, and other obstructions. You can skip this if you don't want to walk around in VR and just want to use the Oculus Quest 2 in a stationary seated or stationary standing position. Once you hit continue, you will see the blue guardian boundary tracing your play area. You will get a warning if you get too close to the edge of this area or step outside. Check that this boundary is correctly positioned and clear of any obstructions. If Guardian is not drawn correctly or you want to change the size or shape of the boundary, click the back arrow to start the Guardian setup. Following the correct setup of Virtual Guardian is important to your safety while using your VR. That's all for now. Thank you for watching. I do hope you learned from this video. See you in the metaverse.